Right, update. I've, uh, this is the end of the second day when I had them all together. But um, I chickened out. I've got the barrier back. Jaws is on one side. And I've got Reggie in with the Litlands on this side. But I've got the barrier. There's, there's a bit more space this side. So there's more room for for the Litlands and Reggie. And um, Jaws has still got that that off but um, basically they're having a lot of they're having a lot of fights um, Jaws and Reggie now Jaws has got the top fin taken out there and he's got some damage to his bottom fin and Reggie has got some damage not this side as he comes around you can see on that side you can see that but there's some damage to the to his body on the side so they've been fighting quite a bit problem Reggie wouldn't back down a lot of the time and I just could see him getting more and more damage because his side I don't know if you can see that sticking out on his side but that's actually tissue damage um, he hasn't seen he doesn't seem too bothered about the Litlands so I thought I'd put him in with the Litlands this side now this barrier when I used to have this barrier by the heater without realizing it I think I got jaws very used to these little guys in a lot of ways because when I took the barrier down he still for the most of the time he still stayed over this side and he was like very respectful of that area where the littlings were the barrier taught him the boundaries if you like in some ways so what I'm hoping is, okay, I've put the barrier up again. Um, hopefully that will give time for Reggie and Jaws to see each other and get used to each other and maybe sort of get a few bar boundaries sorted. I don't know. It's This barrier seems to have trained Jaws to get on with the Littlands in some ways. So I'm, I'm thinking it might actually help to get them used to each other. So, um, go look at that damage. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not sure who did that damage to him, but I'm hoping Reggie leaves him alone. He's had a feed. That roach I put in here earlier, he's, he, they've had some, you saw on video, but he's had some, I was told, my missus told me he, he ate the rest of the roach. So, he's had a feed today. I shall probably feed Jaws tomorrow. So the barrier's back. Here we go. Hopefully the Litlands will be safe from Reggie. What do you reckon, Reg? You can see that damaged body there, the tissue. I just don't want to leave it any longer because I can see something serious happening. Jaws wasn't letting it go really. He was pushing it and pushing it. And Since I've put this barrier on in, they have all calmed down quite a bit. Little ones get a little freaked with him, but not as bad as when Jaws comes along on the scene. Um, but things between these two have definitely calmed down. They can have their little spats either side of the barrier, but not actually hurt each other, which is good. Here we go.